Greetings, everyone. Welcome. Good to see you again. Wonderful. Hmm. Do you ever cry? I wonder what would make you cry? Or when would you cry? Well, I know I cry. And sometimes I cry at a sad movie. I just kind of sometimes put myself into that movie and I think I'm one of the characters. And if there's a dog in that movie, wow, and there's something sad happening, that just makes me want to cry. Yes. Or sometimes you, I might cry when I'm leaving and going to saying goodbye to someone you love. Like I was at the airport in Wyoming where my brother lived and it was time to say goodbye. And I thought, wait, it's going to be a year or two before I will see him again. And that just made me feel definitely like crying. And my voice started getting all shaky and all. Yes, those are times where you feel sad because that good time is over. Um, maybe you might cry when you hurt, you get hurt, you fall down. Yeah, if I get hurt or something and it's really painful, you might cry then. But also, if someone ever hurts my feelings, that really makes me want to cry. I'm, if I don't cry, I might just feel like I really want to cry because feelings are important, right? And sometimes our friends will even do that to us, that they will say something that would really hurt your feelings. Well, people cry for many different reasons. And if we get something in our eye, automatically tears come to our eyes. And then the tears come so much and then you blink and it washes away that little speck or that little insect or that whatever it was that got into your eye. So tears can help wash away, you know, something that shouldn't be there, right? In your eye. And if we're hurt or sad, tears help us ease, kind of ease the pain that we're feeling at that time. So if we miss someone or, or something, like sometimes you might go to somebody's house and you're gonna, and you just miss your mom or your dad, and you really wanna be back. And sometimes crying helps you feel a little better, right? Well, guess what? Jesus cried. Yep, he did. He cried when he was sad. And he comforted his friends when they were sad. So tears are good for us and we can cry when um, we're sad because we know that God will kind of take away our tears. Yes, after you're done crying, you feel a little better. Now listen what, listen what it says in the Bible. And the verse that we're gonna look at, it comes from Isaiah. So what I'm gonna do is go in half in the Bible, halfway through, and Isaiah is in the Old Testament. So I'm gonna go back, not towards the New Testament, go back a little bit, and I'll probably come right, right to Isaiah. And this verse comes from Isaiah 25, verse eight. And it says, the sovereign Lord will wipe away the tears from all faces. Wait a minute, all faces? Yes, the sovereign Lord. Wait, a, what does that mean? Sovereign Lord, Holy Lord, the powerful Lord will wipe away the tears from all faces. Yes, that's what God can do. And that's what makes us feel better. So long ago, when the people of Israel were far, far away from their homes, they cried and they cried to God and they, because they missed their country 
and they miss their other piece of people in their family. But God promised that they would soon go home. And then, then they'd be happy again. So God made a promise to them that they would think. So that's God wiping away their tears. Well, well, God wants us to be happy, just like the Israelites wanted to be happy again, and they were. And that's why God sent Jesus. He sent Jesus, yep, to teach us, that's for sure, but he taught us and to um, help us learn all about God. So God wants us to be happy, but he knows, he knows that there are going to be things that are going to make us sad. And when we're sad, tears can help ease the pain. So don't be afraid to cry. It's okay. Crying's okay. Even Jesus cried. But remember now, God all will always be there to wipe away our tears. Now he doesn't go wipe like this and wipe like this. It means after you're done crying, you feel a little better and you can solve the problem if there is one. And you, that's God helping you wipe the tears away. Right. So let me think. I want to remember that. So I'm going to take this eyedropper and with some water and on my hand I'm going to put a tear. Yeah, it's not a real tear. It's just imaginary tears. So if you were here, I'd put a drop on your hand and your hand and your hand and your hand. We'd all have a drop. And we look at that drop, okay? I'm looking at the tiny little drop on my hand. I know you can't see it because it goes just kind of like invisible there. <laughs> it's, it. it's not a real tear. But it's a reminder that God will wipe our tears away. He will wipe our tears away. So let's pray about that. Everyone ready? Dear God, dear God, thank you for being with us when we are sad. Thank you for being with us when we are sad. Let us help others when they are sad. Let us help others when they are sad. God will take away our tears. God will take away our tears. In your name we pray. In your name we pray. Amen. Now just remember as you're going about this week, and I know it'll be a great week for you, it's so beautiful out there now, that God will what? God will wipe away our tears. Bye everyone, have a great week. See you next week.